It looks like the enemy withdrew for now. Are you still gonna keep running? Courage is the magic that turns dreams into reality. I want to see Daddy one more time. Are you serious? The Vanguard is after Ratatosk's core, remember? Yes, I know. But it's just... This whole time, I haven't done anything but run away. But you've been trying to wake up Ratatosk. That was just a roundabout way of stalling the Vanguard. I was afraid to face my father. He had changed, so I just ran away from him. You're not afraid anymore? I'm afraid, but Emil shared his courage with me. Emil, and the other Emil too. Thank you. My other self said something to you? Yes, he did. Please, let me go to Altamira. Well, either way, the Vanguard knows that Marta's here. I don't really see a problem with her accompanying you. I think so, too. We can protect her. Rain, what do you think? You're against it, right? Oh, why would I be against it? Then it's okay. To tell the truth, I'd prefer to leave you behind. Huh? Never mind. Marta, you can come with us. Thank you. Then it's settled. I'll leave Marta with you, and we can meet up later in front of Altamira. Isn't there some way we can stop all the chaos the Vanguard is causing around the world? I'm sure the Royal Army is marshalling their forces to deal with the situation. So, they'll be coming to Altamira, right? No, that's precisely what the Vanguard's uprisings are designed to prevent. With their forces scattered, the army won't even be able to approach Altamira, especially now that the Vanguard claimed it as its base. Then, the only way to bring down the Vanguard is from the inside. Yes, and the only people that can do that now are us. Yeah, so let's hurry to Altamira. Regal and Sheena need our help. Looks like Orochi isn't here yet. I'm right here. You scared me! Yes, I was quite startled. You don't look very startled. That's our Perseia. Always so cool and calm. No, I told you. He startled me. This conversation is giving me a headache. Let's just drop it. Thank you, Orochi. So what's the situation like in Altamira? It appears the Vanguard established their headquarters in Lesoreno Company Building Number 2. Building Number 2? It was built near Altamira's amusement park. If we attract any attention, the Vanguard will have a welcome party already in waiting for us at their headquarters. Then what should we do? Regal told me there's a tunnel underneath the hotel for employee use. If we can find that, it should take us right in front of building number two. You think of everything, Perseia. You're quite composed for your age. We'll seal off building number two so they can't call reinforcements. We'll take care of the Vanguard soldiers in the city. We'll leave infiltrating their headquarters to you. That's fine. The plan goes into effect at midnight tonight. Don't do anything that might arouse suspicion before then. All right, we should get going as well. Wow, 
They've got this place wrapped up tight. There's no way we'll be able to get in before midnight. What should we do? Starting a fight will get everyone's attention. We just need to get them out of the way, correct? Paw pad. It's Tenebrae. If you're going to call me something ridiculous like Doggy or Paw Pad, I'd prefer you just called me Tenebi. Chill out, Tenebrae. What are you planning on doing? I'm planning on doing this. Nobody can resist the sight of a beautiful woman. Tenebrae, you can transform into anything you want? Yes, because I'm a centurion. Now then, watch a master at work. <laughs> It looks like everything worked out beautifully. <laughs> How long are you planning to stay like that? Why, Emil, honey, don't you like it? Wow, well, that's a switch. Maybe changing his shape changes his personality as well. I miss Pop Head. Anyway, let's wait here until dark. Our operation begins at midnight. Which way is it to the underground tunnel? Regal said all you have to do is get in the elevator and press the button marked for employees. Then let's relax until midnight. <laughs> hey, Tenebrae, the lady you turned into. Is that what Centurions consider to be beautiful? Yes. We Centurions have a highly refined aesthetic sense. Well, what about Rain? Truly a vision of beauty. My. And Prisea? Very lovely indeed. How nice. Okay, what about me? Why, you are beautiful as well, Lady Marta. So then, which of us is the most beautiful of all? I believe that would have to be me. <sighs> you really love yourself, don't you? leads to building number two. <sighs> Prisea? I'm fine. My head just hurts a little. Now that you mention it, I feel a little short of breath all of a sudden. I believe you may be experiencing the effects of Solom's core's increased instability. The core must have been used for some truly nefarious deeds. Its powers have grown even more chaotic. What does that mean for us? The longer we stay here, those without Lord Ratatosk's protection may be affected by the Corps' precarious state and lose their sanity. In other words, we don't have any time to lose. I hope Regal and Sheena are okay. Even if they've been affected by Solon's core, they should return to normal as soon as Lady Marta hatches it. So if we find Brute and get the core back, everything will be settled. That's right. Daddy. Marta, are you all right? I'm fine. I have the courage you gave me. 